Hello, my name is X2, I'm VFX Axis, and today I want to show you how to disable permanent how to disable permanent virus from internet from your PC. Uh, so let's get started. My English is not good enough, but I think you can understand. So let's get started. First, uh, I'm going to show you how those files delete my my program like Adobe you can see here see see open program file oh. as you can see you can see or application turn it to zero KB. See to say find exe. You can see zero byte are uh, everywhere. Everywhere zero byte zero byte zero byte zero byte. This means I can do anything. I can do anything. See, even if I start my program here, just say. Mm -hmm. So, how to fix this? If you need to fix this permanent, first of all, uh, I want to show you first how the virus is inter. How the virus is going to enter in your computer. So I got three file here, two, two file above, two file above are my real file, but this one called the activator, this one is the virus. So I want to show you how by mist mistaken, ah, shit, virus is going to kill me okay i'm going to open it now the virus is in my computer is it in my computer the virus so how to find it to find where it's going after you open that's fine First, you're gonna go to organize <coughs> folder and search option, view, show hidden file, and say that, and go to C, and you're gonna see the file card boot. That is where the virus live. You see. S Y S Y win S Y S S Y S win that is a virus kill my program every day when I wake up open file by mistake my all application is gone man in a minute so we have to do something about it whatever it take we have to do something so i have to do something so how to delete it first and disable first we, go, we have to delete it and second we have to we have to make sure that virus don't enter in the computer again so First of all, you have to open Window Task Manager. Open Window Task Manager by pressing Control Shift Escape on Window. So Window, and then open and and uh, go to Process. Uh, when you are in Process, and end the process, search for S Y. S win 
the txe and the end the process okay when you finish to end the process just pause it and go to your c here boot go disk c boot and open your file just delete the file i delete the file inside it that is the virus i'm going to delete it okay after you delete it you go back that is where we are going to disable permanent because when we don't disable that virus again when uh, i'm open my flash my flash this is my flash and when i go to any file uh, with that virus for example this one this one above is it said intel utility is the uh, one with virus when i open it the virus is going to int again in my computer in the same folder in the same folder remember it so when we we already did it but we, when we open the virus again if you go into that boot folder again you're gonna see the file is in there even if you delete it the file going there okay so i'm going to delete it again and i'm gonna to make it that file virus never never enter in my pc okay now it's going to be hard to delete because i didn't end the process in window task manager so i'm going to end the process like i'm showing before end the process okay after i'm ending the process and i delete it okay the file is gone so after that what you have to do is to play with window security okay now i'm right click and say property okay property and go to security you, all you have to do is to turn everything on this file then 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 okay i'm going to edit and i say authenticated user then okay apply i say yes okay system i say then apply okay say continue we're gonna click continue as you can okay Admi administrator then going to apply click continue as you can okay then user say then okay and apply click continue okay now click ok click continue try okay now now all the file is applied the attribute don't worry if the property here don't disappear but the system setting is already applied as you see okay now all you have to do all you have to do is restart your pc so i'm um, first of all i'm going to show you how the how the system security work after the setting we have changed nothing can enter in the in this file for example let's see i'm gonna i want to copy this driver on those for on boot the file okay now you see you need a permission to perform this action come on as you see so as long as you disable all the security nothing can hit in this file let's see again i'm going to my flash and find that virus again and open it now i open it and nothing happened but that file that virus didn't enter in my system so how i know that file did not enter in my system i know because when i go to window task manager like before that that application or virus i can I, I can't find it there so this is mean that the the system is working correct and nothing can enter 
and again my english is not good as as good is not good enough but i think you understand what i'm talking about thank you for watching